welcome to the world's most famous arena here in Manhattan. Vancouver's coming into this one on the second leg of a back-to-back -back here tonight, Ray. Yeah, it's a couple that you're on the road where you're unfamiliar, you've got travel. There is a challenge to this, but the focus of the team has to be about playing a good first period. Worry about the rest of the game later. A sight every hockey fan can appreciate. It's a clean sheet of ice that we are about to get underway. The Canucks take possession here on the opening draw, and we are underway. Let's one go. Makes the save. Grabbed along the board by Besser. Oh, and another big stop. Nice work in there. After the first stop, he's got to find the puck to save the second. Loose puck battle along the boards. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. And it's a quick pass to Miller. They've got the defense outnumbered. New York's got control of it now from their own end. Moves it to Zabinijan. Taken by Edler. Nice pass. Vancouver's got it along the wall. Stones him in front. And that's blocked away. Vancouver's got it, and they're on the attack. Big time stop! Gets a blocker on it! Strom's got it across. Strom's got the puck. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Puck scooped up by Toffoli. They've got numbers. Snaps one here in the slot. And that shot dies in traffic. Stretches one out to Fox. We get a whistle and they'll do it all over at the other end. Yeah, of course, the team that iced the puck isn't able to change players. A rule put in a couple of seasons ago. Horvath's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And that's blocked. Is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. And now he moves it to Bushnevich. Puts it on net, locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Puck picked up by Tanev. Vancouver's moving it into the offensive end. Shot, and that one stopped. Vancouver's on the attack. Centering pass. Whoa. He scores. They tell you it doesn't have to hit the back of the net. It's just got to get over the goal line for it to count. That one does. The goalie had a big chunk of it. Just not enough. Vancouver's got the game's first goal. How much of a difference does that make? Completely change your mindset, even with lots of time left. You can be more aggressive with the comfort that you have a 1-0 lead. Takes a shot, and he comes up with it. Vancouver's up here in the first, and they could easily be up by more based on what they've done offensively. Vancouver's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Denies him on the slobber! New York's got a hold of it along the wall. New York's got possession here in the neutral zone. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Vancouver's in now. Here's a shot, comes up with the stop. New York's looking to break out of their own end. We got a penalty coming up here on the play. Whistle blown, stopping the play. Well, the official's going to give him two minutes to think about that one. Yeah, you can argue for a few seconds, James, I guess, but you already know at this point you're going to sit down. The Rangers get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. They've been running around trying to get this game tied up. 
They earn a power play, and now they'll have that chance. Quick puck movement always seems to work best for them. Vancouver's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Gets it out of his own end. Carries it across the line. Centered out in front! Here's an opportunity in front of the net. Taken along the wall by Zabinijad. Routine save made by Demko. Vancouver's got a chance to work the transition game now, shorthanded, and manages to clear the zone. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Into the offensive end now. Here's the pass. Wow. Scores! Power play goal! Uh, critical for them to get on the board with the extra man. They move the puck well, and they're able to pass the line. are usually more conservative killing penalties than this. They make a mistake, now they give up the man advantage break. The power play doesn't miss on the rush. Past the midway mark of the frame, we got a tie game. This neutral zone faceoff set to go and we are back underway. New York's gained possession along the boards. Quick pass to D'Angelo. Moves the puck behind the net. Slides it back to the blue line. Huge steal in his own end. Vancouver's on the attack. Vancouver's got the puck against the half wall. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. New York's got the puck along the wall. Takes the feed. Denies him! Demko's able to get out and make the save on that great A chance. Scooped up along the wall by Miller. Denied by the goaltender. And that's a great read to pick off the pass. Slides the puck near the front of the net. Gives them nothing in front. Aggressive stop out on top of the crease to make the save on a dangerous chance. Smart heads up, play to neutralize the threat. Vancouver's got it in the offensive zone. Big time stop. One minute left. In the first Clock period. ticking down here inside the first period. On the attack along the boards. Vancouver's got the puck in their own end. Works it across to Sutter. Slides it over to Hughes. 1-1 is where we sit after the first 20 minutes of play. Don't forget to check out our top 10 moments in hockey history. You can find it on our website, posted on by you, our fans. And while both teams get a refresher, we'll take one ourselves heading into the second period. And we are just moments away from the start of period number two. And we are underway, still tied up here in the second. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? New York's in a tie game, which is kind of miraculous because they turned the puck over way too much in the first period. Shuts him down. And another stop. Really good stop. After he made the first one, he's got to find the puck and he's in position again. Moves it quickly over to Hughes. Picked up along the boards by Pedersen. New York's got a hold of it along the wall. Puck grabbed by Smith. And now he moves it quickly to Strom. And there's the whistle. Icing is the call, which I gotta say is like almost the equivalent of a tie. Who likes icing? It might be the most boring play in hockey, but you get an offensive zone face off. Hey, there's a victory. James Sabalski, Ray Ferraro with you here in the early going of this period. It's all tied up. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive Whoa. zone. Picked up along the wall by Myers. Snaps one from the slot. He gets a piece of it with a stick. Picks it off in the offensive end. Wide of the net. You put this. Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. There's the whistle stopping play. Penalty coming up here. 
The good old-fashioned hook has sent him off to the box. He's almost in the right position, but he's got to give him a little hook. When he gives that tongue, he goes to the penalty box. It gets called every time. Vancouver's man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Key for any team on the power play is to get control of the puck first. So we'll look at the faceoff, and this power play at the very least has to generate a little momentum. It's their first crack at it tonight. Vancouver's got the puck along the boards. Vancouver's got it across the line. And now it's over to Furland. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. Along the half wall with the puck. Puts it on net from the point. Too much traffic in the lane. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Kicked up ahead to his teammate who skates away. Good hit on the play. The Rangers gain control of the puck against the wall. And that's broken up. In all alone on the breakaway. Oh, and he misses. These are the ones when you put your head on the pillow that you can't get out of your mind. You didn't do these, did you? Always. Gets in front of it. Centering pass. From the slot, wrist shot, stopped by the goaltender. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. New York's got possession while undermanned. Over the line they come. Haley's going to play it to the corner. Penalty expires. You really have to admire the effort of the penalty-killing unit on that one as both teams are back to even strength. That's a long time to sit in the penalty box when the game is tied and you've just taken a penalty to put your team shorthanded. But he gets bailed out. The penalty kill does an excellent job. That was a big hit. You've got to be willing to put your own body on the line to make a hit like that. Still lots of time left here in this frame. You can feel the energy in this crowd. It's a tie game. And now it's grabbed by Stahl. Vancouver's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Oh, just a textbook hit. Trying to gain a step. All alone. Slides it across. Vancouver's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Blistering shot. Answers it with an even better save. Straight up the middle. Here they come. Quick feed to Panarin. Vancouver's got control of it now from their own end. Vancouver's across the blue line. Puts it on goal and makes the save. Here's a short pass to Strom. Strom's got it along the wing. Oh, and he can thank his stick for that one. Into the offensive zone. Moves it to Myers, and he slides it quickly to Tanev. What a save! He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Gets it over to Levo. Lays into the body. Here's a chance out front, and that's broken up with a stick in front with the steal. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall, and he loses both the puck and his balance after that hit. And there's the save. Takes the feed from the goaltender. Intercepts it at center. Vancouver's got the puck in the defensive end. Vancouver's got the puck against the boards. Heads deep inside the offensive zone. And that one's turned away. He's sharp on this one, out on top of the crease aggressively to make the save. Vancouver's got a hold of it against the wall. He's got a step. What a stop by the goaltender. Yeah, he was able to gauge his speed against the skaters. He moved back nicely with him to make the stop. Oh, there's going to be a penalty on this play here, James. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Play is blown dead. We've got a penalty on the way. Berlin's been called for holding. Well, next time he's going to have to find a better way to get in front of the player. He reaches out, grabs him, he'll go to the box. I feel like you could have got away with this back in your day. You could get away with a lot in our day. <laughs> Play resumes as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Gets it out of his own end. New York's gained possession along the boards. Carries it in. And now he tries to get it across to Bushnevich. 
D'Angelo's moving the puck through his own zone. Receives the pass. Grabs the puck here in their own end. Demko's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Here in the late going of the frame, we are all tied up in this one. Puck is dropped and we are back underway. And manages to clear the zone. New York's got the puck behind the net. Quick feed to Panarin. Panarin scudded against the boards. Whoa. Scores! And he puts his team in front. James, this game looked really comfortable as a tie game. Now they're ahead. They've got to continue to push. They saw a quick opportunity here on the man advantage. They get out on the odd man break. They move the puck around nicely and they capitalize. New York's gonna try to hang on to this lead here in the late goings of this second. And it's not by back on your heels, it's by being aggressive, by forechecking play defense in the other team's end. He says, let's get physical on that play. Takes a shot off a stick. Fox is moving it ahead. Move to the middle. Shot. Oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Well, that probably would work a little better if the stick stayed in one piece. No luck in that stick. Vancouver's got the puck along the wall. Dumps it into the O zone. The Rangers have a hold of it in the defensive zone. Takes the feed. Referee's got his hand up, signaling a delayed penalty. Horn sounds to end the second period. 2-1 is where things sit. Still anybody's game as we will head into the third period. If you want to show off your accuracy, register now for our Shoot to Win contest where one lucky fan will shoot... Don't go anywhere. Third period is coming up, and it's coming up next. Vancouver's man advantage unit will start the period with a full two-minute power play. Pedersen's going to play it against the half wall. That goes off the stick. In tight, he had to make an excellent save. Heedle's swooping in on the attack. And that one's broken up by a great defensive play. Dishes it to Pedersen. Slides it across. Oh, gets a glove on it to make the stop. New York's got it in their own zone. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Denies them on the play. Vancouver's got a hold of it along the wall. Now he takes it over the line. On the doorstep. With the stop. Stall stick handling in his own zone. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Flips it up the net. With the stop. Here's a shot. Denies him again and tries to make a diagonal pass to Hughes. Handles the puck at the point. Stops the rocket of a shot. I wanted to look at this again to show you how the goaltender tracks the puck across the front of the net on the play to make the save. Lots of time left in this period. It's a 2-1 game. The Canucks will go to work here in the offensive zone. Drives into the front of the net and makes the save. This is a quality chance that the goaltender turns aside right from the slot. And he slides it quickly to Pearson. Slides the paddle in there and pokes it away. Really smooth stop here as he deflects this puck into the corner out of danger. Saucer Whoa. pass. Scores! A short hanging goal! Well, you're just trying to kill the penalty off. This is terrific work as they take advantage of a little bit of a bobble and they go ahead and capitalize shorthanded. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. New York 
us off to a great start to this period as they extend the lead. Puck hit the ice and they were aggressive right from the beginning. I like the way that they played the first bit of this third period. Now they have a little bit more of a comfortable cushion. Denies him in front. Quick pass to D'Angelo. Picks up the puck in his own end. Here's a chance. Here he is in close. Big save. The most fun save for the goaltender, the glove stop. Vancouver's been the better team, but not necessarily boasting the better goaltender, trailing early in the third. Strom's won the face. What a shot he scores! Oh, man, the goalie thought he had this cover, James. You can tell from his body language when it beats him, hits the post, and goes in. The defensive team can't get control of the puck off this face-off. It ends up into the shooter's hands, and he beats the goaltender. there tonight, but Ray, I can imagine it's a different story on the other side of the bench. Yeah, half the guys out here are having fun. The other half, this game can't end quick enough. Moves the puck along the half wall. Knocked away. Stopped by the goaltender. Time of the goal. Three minutes, 23 seconds. Still plenty of time left in this frame. New York's really put the squeeze on here now, up by three. And as the puck is dropped, they win the draw here inside the defensive zone. Grabbed along the board by Vertanen. Looks to pass it to Toffoli. Here they are on the attack. Let's the wrister fly. And misses over the net. You can go games without a chance from here. Centering pass. And here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Taken by Myers. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Can't keep a hold of it. Slides the pass over to Faust. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. With possession along the wall. Wrist one, stopped by the goaltender. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. With all kinds of traffic, he grabs the puck here inside his own end. Moves it quickly over to Pedersen. Stopped by the goaltender. Oh, aggressive move as he pokes it away. Oh, and a great defensive play there. Quick feed to Pearson. Hammers a shot. What a stop as he puts out the fire. Slides it over with pace to Tanev. On the backhand. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. He's got to do something a little better than that. Just can't finish it from there. Wonder if that gives him a nightmare later. Gives it right back. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. Out front, and that's picked off in front. Takes the pass from his goaltender. Icing is the call here, and those winded bodies are gonna be out there for an extended period here now. Yeah, they can't get a change in, and so you go back, you kind of meander your way back as long as you can to kill time and get a little breath. More than half the period has expired. A lot of offense in this one, mostly from one side. We've got 4-1 the score. The Rangers get a hold of the puck in their own end. Takes the pass. Kreider's got it into offensive territory. And that one's broken up. Vancouver's looking to break out. There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play. If you're not sure what's going on, freeze the puck. Vancouver's got to be frustrated with how things have played out tonight, trailing in this third period. Strom's won the draw. Let's it fly. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Grabs the puck right in front and tries to escape the pressure. New York's ready to go on the attack. Puts it to the front of the net. Great read by the goalie as he pokes it away with a stick. Get that slop out of here. He makes the stop. And there's no rebound. Off in the corner it is. And we've got a two-on-one. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Here in the late goings of the period, and we've got a 4-1 hockey game. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. Another stop by the goaltender. 
Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. Pile driving hit. James, I didn't see that coming. He closed the ice there so quickly, and he just laid him out. Offside is the call, and we'll have a face-off just outside the offensive zone. I wanted to get another look at this one, James. This looks like it hurts. I'm glad I'm in a suit here. Vancouver's offensive struggles have been the story tonight. Lots of chances, just not a lot of results. Face off here in the neutral zone, and we are back underway. Look out, a two on one. Here he is, wristed on net. Gobbles the puck up there with the chest. Vancouver's had more shots on goal, but yet they've run into a hot goalie. They trail late in this third period. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Taken along the wall by Panarin. Nice poke check. Trying to escape the pressure. Puck scooped up by Zabinijad. Tees it up, big time stop there. Takes it across the blue line. Rips it, and he comes up with a big time save on that. Here's an odd man rush to his teammate. Jabs the puck away. Puck picked up by Fantenberg. Moves the puck into the attacking area. Puts it on goal, and he makes the save. Scoops up the puck here. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Blocked in traffic. Here they come on the attack. Tries to dangle and the puck skips away. Pedersen's in good position to create a scoring chance, but he bobbles the puck and the chance is gone. And he says no! Directed over to Hedo. And that'll close the book on this one as the final horn sounds. That's a tough loss for them, James. I mean, they did a lot of things right. The face-offs were good, a lot of details good. They just didn't get enough done to win. Can you see those positives after a game like this, though? Not right now. Maybe tomorrow. For my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, my name is James Cebalski. Thanks so much for joining us. Good night.